Hi, you are welcome to my channel. My name is Victor Epo. There are some times you will on your uh, your laptop, your current drawer, and you will see that you don't have anything displayed on the screen, like for your toolbox, your menu bar, it won't appear there. And you'll be wondering how you can restore them back to how you can restore them so that you'll be able to work on your project. So for this, let me just quickly show you how to do that. You right click anywhere on the screen. You can right click anywhere. You can right click anywhere on the screen. You come over to your view. You select your view. You come over to toolbox, and you see that your toolbox is already here. So to come up with your uh, color palette, your menu bar, and the rest. You click on this, you come over to your view, come to color palette, uh, then you set your document palette. So, okay, the document palette is for the one under, so as if you create any of your colors. So, let me click on view again and go back to my color palette. Then, uh, let me say, okay. Color styles. Let me go back to uh, my palette editor. No. Color palettes. Default palettes. Okay. Yeah. So you see your color is out here. Come over to your view. Okay, to get your menu bar now, let me just right click on this place. Okay, it's not there yet. So you come over to view and you click on your property bar. So the same process, you right click, you come over to your view, you come over to property bar and you click on it. Now you see that this one is out here. And to do all that, so to do all that, you can just right click on this place because the prop uh, the property bar is out already. So you just right click on this place, and you choose your menu bar. So in choosing your menu bar, you see that all these ones is out. You right click there again. You click on your status bar. The status bar is uh, some. Yeah, okay, let's let me off that and see where it came from. Okay, it's under. So just click that. You right click again. Standard. So that is how you say when when you right click for the standard, this one came up. If you want to add that, you can right click and just hide on any one here. Let me see this zoom. Okay, you see that this one is here. So if you want to apply it, and for this, you see that it's movable. Now I want to bring it to this place. I will just um, hold my left key down and drag. When you see something like this, then you leave it. You see that it has applied to this so you can add as many as possible but for your screen not to be too uh, clumsy you can just remove some uh, the ones you are not using you can just remove it let me see let me see for this standard okay let me remove standard so that is how you can do it and for this let me see for this, you see that uh, it's showing your lock toolbars. So if I should uncheck this now, just watch out. If I uncheck it, you see that I can move anything out. I can move this one out. So in doing that, uh, it might you can mistakenly just move it out, and you'll be looking for uh, how to fix it back. So the thing you will do is just you left click on it, you drag it here. Once it's showing cell uh, net like this, you leave it and it will apply there. And for this also, you just drag it to where you want it to be. Then, uh, sorry. Uh -huh. 
like this something like this because i want it to be straight like this i just leave it so once you are done with that you right click and you come over to this place and lock it so that you won't be able to move it again so that is how you can just uh, restore the missing uh, documents the missing toolbars on your current drawer so thanks guys for watching this to the end don't forget to subscribe hit the notification bell so that you mean you won't miss out of any of my tutorial and hit the like button so that it can the video can go to other subscribers that are willing or that would want to learn something like this so thanks guys for watching this to the end see you in another video